It's a great day. My name is Shay Brown and we help you make more sales with less effort. And I'm so excited today on revenuetalks.com and you can join us over at revenuetalks.com because perhaps as you're out there every single day doing what you're doing, you feel stuck in your sales conversations. Or you need to know what can I say to move the prospect to action. And perhaps you're doing the best that you can. Perhaps you never worked with a, a sales expert or certainly not the sales cardiologist or, or maybe you've heard some things but you haven't really applied them yet. You've heard them but you haven't really applied them. Jot this down in your notes. I want you to have this because the time has come for you to apply it. Sales is the number one key metric in business. Jot that down in your notes. Sales is the number one key metric in business, according to Shea Brown. That's why it's a Sheaism, right? So you've got to generate sales in order to hit your revenue goal and your revenue targets. And when you do that, then it makes your life so much easier. Now I want to tell you about Cynthia because Cynthia has been someone who's been in training. She's worked with a number of coaches. She's been through $5,000 programs, $10,000 programs, and she's really good at what she does. So unlike some folks who are stuck in the conversation, she was in the conversation, but the revenue wasn't accelerated. She wanted to break that $20,000 a month barrier, which is a, a big barrier to get over, except that she does some, some contracts. So she, could, she can get there from, from an income perspective, but she needed a little help. And she felt like she was at a, at a pivotal place where she wasn't landing some of the big deals. And we had a conversation and I said, well, share with me What's going on in your conversation? Share with me what happens on the third or fourth time that you're meeting. Tell me exactly what you're sharing. If you don't mind, share what the client is sharing as well. Now that might be you. You might be ready to have a income breakthrough, but yet something's holding you back. For her, she didn't have the techniques that I'm going to teach you. She didn't and wasn't aware of hypnotic sales approach. Jot that down in your notes. The hypnotic sales approach that allows you to speak to your prospect on a subconscious mind and say what they're thinking before they say it and then point them in the direction you want them to go. Now this is not about manipulation. Okay, it really isn't. I mean, you can use some of these, these, uh, these techniques that we'll be sharing as part of Revenue Talks. You can use them and you can manipulate pe folks. You can try to make them do things they don't want to do. You can use it for evil. But ah, I'm not suggesting you do that. I'm not teaching you and sharing this with you to do that. Just like Cynthia, she didn't want to manipulate someone, but she wanted to use it for good. She knew she could solve their problems. You've heard me say it before and I'll say it again. Jot this in your notes. People will pay you today if you help them solve a problem today. We're in a problem solving business. So let's talk today about the hypnotic sales approach. The hypnotic sales approach. And I'm gonna give you three steps that you can use. How many steps did I say? Three. One, two, three. So you can be like Cynthia. You can relate to your prospect. You can move them forward and you can know what you're gonna say and why you're saying it. Now, hypnotic in its true sense is when you put someone in a, in a trance. But from a sales perspective, which is how we see the world through a sales lens, it's about speaking them, speaking to them through their subconscious mind. And you're planting these thoughts right in the back of their mind. Just like right now. Right now, I'm installing sales success software. Sales success software is being put on your brain right now. And you're going to be successful. Why? Because of two reasons. Look below, look below, just look below and share your first name, share your last name, and share these two words. Share these two words. Principles plus practice. Principles plus practice. Principles plus pra practice. Hashtag sales courage. You got it? Did you get it? Go ahead and put your name down there. Go ahead right now and put, type in principles plus practice equals sales success. Principles, so I'm going to share some foundations, some fundamentals. And never underestimate the power of the basics. There are some principles that you need to be aware of that I'm going to share. It's going to help you. But it's only going to help you if you practice. That's why we say principles plus practice are the keys to sales success. That's a Shaism. You can go ahead and jot that down. You can write that down because I believe that. See, I can share with you the hypnotic sales approach. We can watch videos and you can learn it, but it's kind of like swimming. I can teach you how to swim. I can write books about swimming. I can do videos about swimming, but until you jump in the pool and you actually start swimming, you never learn how to do it. 
All right, so let's get down to the hypnotic sales approach so you can move people to action. Principles plus what? Practice equals sales success. Shayism, you can use that. RevenueTalks.com, I'm excited. So let's go through and let's share. Let's show them, let's just show them up front. You know what? I'm not gonna hold back. We're gonna go through a philosophy that has three steps. Show them if you would for a moment. Point, tell, paint. Jot that down in your notes. Point, tell, paint. In fact, I want you in the feed below. Now, if you do this, I'm gonna share a very special gift with you. But just look below, type in your first name, because I wanna know who you are. Type in your last name, let's do that. And then write these words, point, tell, paint. Point, tell, paint. This is part of the hypnotic sales approach. I want you to know that. Later on, we'll, we'll get into some, some other things that you can do. But you have this for your notes right now. Point, tell, paint. So let's look at number one. Let's go behind number one. And number one is point. I'm going to give you the, the sales scripting. I'm going to give you the language patterns to go with it so you kind of understand the how-tos, the how-tos when you're painting, the how-tos when you're pointing. You've got to point them in the direction you want them to go, and you've got to relate them back to the problem they have. So for example, and I think we're going to show this on a slide right now. For example, you're talking to them, and they're like, you know, Shay, I really need to attract more qualified clients because we believe in what? Attract, engage, convert. Attract, engage, convert. That's a process. They say, Shay, I'm struggling with attracting the right clients. So I'll say, so you want a lead generation system. That's the language you see it. You want blank. You want blank. I'm pointing them in the right directions. You want a lead generation system that will attract high qualified leads. Is that correct? Um, you need a brand that folks recognize when they see it and they connect it to how you solve their problem. Is that correct? See, we're pointing them in the right direction, so we gotta give them the how. We gotta give them the how up there. We gotta give them the how. So this is how we're doing it. We're putting their mind back on the problem. See, sometimes when you're in a conversation, it goes a little like this and a little like that, and, 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 and sometimes there's a whole lot going on back and forth, and when that happens, they kind of get off direction. They forget the problem they have. Um, for example, perhaps they want to get a new website. And you, they start talking about the website, then they start talking about their business, and they're so engaged, and you're engaged, and you're off track, and you got to bring them back. So you say, you want a website that folks can go to and learn about your business. Is that correct? The answer is yes. So we're going to point out the reason they're buying in the first place. Jot that down in your notes. Point out the reason they're buying in the first place. So this is all about pointing, pointing, pointing them in the right direction that you want the prospects to go. This is a, a shame. I mean, you, you, you're going to love it, but I want you to put this in your notes. Someone put this in the share below. Either you control the conversation or the conversation controls you. Say that again a little slower. Either you control the conversation or the conversation controls you. So you point them back in the right direction. You want to control the conversation. And then you get them refocused on where they're going. And here's one example. I gave you an example, but I want to show you an example right now because we're pointing them in the right direction. Person wanted a website. You talked to them about a website. They really wanted one. What you want to start off with these two words, I know that you want a website that will help you attract the right clients. I know you want a sales script so you don't sound salesy when you're talking to other folks. I know you want an automation tool and a system and a structure that generates income when you're not there. I know you want an insurance product that would be the best it possibly can in the world. See, now we pointed them in the right direction. So Cynthia, who was just like you, she can relate to this because she was trying to point people in the right direction. I'm just like you, I wasn't strategically, consciously pointing people in the right direction. But once I learned the evergreen revenue model, I'll come back to that another time, but the evergreen revenue model, which is the number one business strategy that allows you to generate income without your labor. And underneath there, there are some sequences. And once I learned this evergreen sales sequence, I said, that's it. That's the missing piece, the hypnotic sales approach. Hey, I'm so glad we're here at revenuetalks.com. If you want the notes, you want to join, please, please do that. I'm going to go on to point number two. I'm going to go on to point number two. Let's, let's share with you point number two. They're going to show it to you in a moment. Don't you, I love the noise. Don't you just love that noise? I love it. Tell. 
So first we point them in the right direction and then we've got to tell them exactly how we're going to solve their problem. So our extreme business makeover will do that for you. Um, our sales scripting program will do that for you. Our strategic copywriting team will do that for you. They'll get you the results you want from your website, from your webinars, from your conference call. See, we first we pointed out the problem and then we now tell them, so go ahead and look below. Look, look below and I want you to jot this one idea down. Jot this one idea. Remind them of the key issue. Remind them of the key issue. Remind them of the key issue. See, when we're telling them, we're reminding them of the issue they had in the very beginning. We pointed it out, but then we strategically right behind that came and said, you know what, I know you want a lead generation system to attract high qualified prospects. Our closing mastery program will do that for you. See, that's the key. I know you want to generate revenue. These revenue talks, join us over at revenuetalks.com. These revenue talks, they will help you generate more revenue in your business because that's what the conversation is about. You're going to reassure them and you're going to make the purchase real. But I want you to be specific. I want you to be very, very specific. When you attend our closing mastery program and you arrive in Laurel, and you show up the very first day, you're going to immediately, instantly get exactly what you need right there. Okay. Let me give you, let me give you an example of tell because that's going to be very, very important. You're going to tell them exactly what you do. So our lead generation system will do that for you. That's exactly what it was designed to do. So we point them in the right direction. This is hypnotic sales approach. It's happening on a subconscious level. They have no idea it's there. But here's the key. Here's the key. We're going to remove the risk of them not being clear. Now I shared with you recently that a confused mind rarely buys. Right? You remember that? A confused mind rarely buys. And now I'm back saying that people buy clarity. People buy clarity. And so now that we're there, we're going to, someone just below, just jot this down, put this in the notes right below. We're going to remove the risk and close the deal. Remove the risk and close the deal. That's the key part. Okay, now we pointed out the problem. We got to refocus. Yes, 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 yes. We told them and reminded them of why we do what we do and how it's going to solve their problem. Yes, Shay, point, tell. What's the last one, Shay? Point, tell. What's the last one? Look, I'm giving you a structure. I'm giving you in threes. I like things that are, that are simple. Simple is easy and easy is duplicatable. Jot that down in your notes. Simple is easy and easy is duplicatable. What I'm teaching you right now is simple. And it's easy once you understand the formula and you have the distinction that the hypnotic sales approach, the hypnotic sales approach, that, 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 that the selling is a learned skill. You, my friend, you, you can learn to sell. See, you can learn to sell. Okay, let me give you the last one. Let me give you the last one. Number three, number three over here is paint. You're going to paint the picture for them. When you own this product, when you take this step, when you sign the contract, when you leave our three-day boot camp, you're going to be really, really happy you did because you have a seven figure revenue generating infrastructure. So we're going to paint the picture at, at an advanced level under hypnotic sales approach. And maybe I'll come back later and teach at an advanced level under hypnotic sales approach. It's called future pacing. Future pacing is when you take the prospect into the future. They see themselves there before they get there. In this case, you're painting the picture. You're giving the illustration. See, point, tell, paint all part of the hypnotic sales approach. Now maybe you're a sales professional, you're a business owner, you're a coach, you are um, a speaker, maybe you're a consultant and you're on the phone. You say, Shay, I can't see them. Will these principles work for me although I'm not on the phone? The answer to that question is yes. The answer to that question is yes. So how do you paint it? How do you paint it? What are some examples you can do? When you own this, you're going to experience this. But the words you're going to say, and there are three words, is when you 
own this product, when we work together, when we get started. See, they see themselves there. If I was selling your cars, I would say, when you arrive home in your brand new car, your neighbors are going to view you as a success. You're going to feel a sense of pride when you arrive at your congregation, at your service. See, this is important. This is what it's all about. Point, tail, paint. It's a segment of the hypnotic sales approach, which is a part of the evergreen revenue model. And once I learned the evergreen revenue model, it just made a shift for me because my life got so easier. But I promise you a big surprise. And you're one in Shay. It says, can't wait. First, look below and go ahead and send a text. Now, if you want the notes, you want to stay in this conversation, you want the five gifts that we have, go ahead and text the word revenue, text the word revenue to 240-428-6333. Again, 240-428-6333. But the big surprise, this is what you're waiting on. You're waiting on the big surprise. Can't wait. See the smiley face? <laughs> Let's see what the big surprise is. Let's see what we have here for you. Two additional bonuses. Shay, what does point tell and paint do it creates a unconscious thought of direction so that means once you painted them and you painted the picture for them and they saw where they were going it was reconnected on a subconscious level they saw themselves somewhere they're not they thought about owning the product that means they're going to buy again we use this for good not for evil we use this for good not for evil but now we've created that unconscious direction of thought. Isn't that what you wanted? But let me give you the double bonus and then I'm going to finish up. I'm so excited. Take a look. Say what you want them to think. That's right. At the end of the day, when you are pointing out what's going on and you're reminding them of their problem, you're saying what's on their mind. It's on a subconscious level. That's why it's a hypnotic sales approach, but you're bringing it back to the front of their brain. Then you're telling them, because they got to hear you. Remember, some people got to, I don't know if you caught the last segment. If you didn't, go back and see it, right? There was the eyes, the ears, and the emotion. The eyes, the ears, and the emotion. Now that you told them, you painted the picture, you say what you want them to think. See, that's the hypnotic sales approach. When you do that, it just makes life so much easier. And isn't that why you got into business? Think about it. You became an entrepreneur because there was a problem that existed. And you had a commitment deep down. You've got a big heart. You have the right product. You're trying to do the right thing. And you are committed to helping other folks. Like right now, I am committed. I'm on a mission. I need your help. I'm on a mission to help 10 million sales professionals over the next 10 years make more sales with less effort. And until my days end on this earth, I'm gonna do everything I possibly can. And through the power of those fiber optic lines, through the power of the travel, through the power of the books, the podcast, the videos, the training models, our digital university, we're gonna help 10 million sales professionals. We're gonna change the paradigm of what folks think about sales, and they're gonna come back and they're gonna understand that selling really is about service. And when you serve other folks, at the end of the day, we don't really build your business and we don't really make it easier, although we do that. At the end of the day, we help you create legacy wealth that you can pass on to future generations. Some of you out there, you want to start a school and this income will help you start a school. Some of you out there want to support your family. They're dependent on you for insurance, for their meals. It, that's what the revenue will do for you. And others of you, you want to leave it behind. You got future generations that are coming after you. It's your contribution. This is your gift. So with that being said, I want you to remember to use the hypnotic sales approach. Join us again on revenuetalks.com. You now can relate. You now can connect. Hit the button below. And I want you to tell yourself, just type in your name and just put I believe. Type that right now. Type in your first name. Type in your last name. Uh, um, type in where you're from. I like to know where you're from. Type in where you're from. And look, type it right now where you're from. And then go ahead and type in I believe. So you believe you can use the hypnotic sales approach. You believe that you can point, tell, and paint. And even if you don't believe that this can happen, even if you don't believe it, tell yourself every morning you wake up, the Shea Brown, I hold the belief for you. Because sometimes you need someone else to believe in you. They gotta believe you're a winner. They gotta believe you're a champion. They gotta believe you have greatness. They gotta believe that the best is still yet to come for you. So with that being said, do three things. Always be humble. Serve other folks the best you can. Always stay hungry. Learn every single day. 
and always hustle. Give your best energy and your best effort every single day. You do that and you will be successful. So my name is Shay Brown, the sales cardiologist. Make it a great day, everyone. And we're gonna make some good things happen. We connect again next time. God bless you all. Thanks for joining. See you soon.